My name is Paul Deary and my research is in the area of equality and inequalities in higher education. The topic has many dimensions. It's a very fast changing uh, area of research. It touches upon, for example, uh, education policy and its values. The values, let's say, of employability, entrepreneurship, which are very prevalent in higher education policy at the present time. These are valued as norms of good citizenship, and that clearly has implications for what we mean by equality and inequality in our society. The topic touches upon the commercialization and the marketization of higher education. Another aspect which is closely related to those two is the way in which we visualize excellence in higher education. University ranking products proliferate today, telling us what a good and a bad education is, what a good and a bad university might look like. Of course, um, there are other factors such as the digitalization of higher education to take into account. This has been progressing apace uh, for, for decades, but at the present time with the coronavirus pandemic, uh, there has been a vast acceleration in the digital provision uh, of higher education. And that doesn't come uh, without problems. There is a, an imperfect market uh, that exists in higher education which has very weak links to labour markets. Um, this can be a cause of uh, inequality too. Um, higher education is becoming increasingly digitised um, and this means that there might be digital inequalities affecting uh, opportunities within higher education. And these are at the present time accelerated by the coronavirus pandemic and the consequences it has had upon the change delivery of higher education. I find the, the question of equality and inequality in higher education to be very fast paced and changing and very interesting. I have three PhD students at the moment. Uh, one is doing research in inequalities in higher education, mostly looking at um, legislation and educational policy. Another is uh, doing research on um, something called Christian Zionism and lobby groups uh, that operate within the USA at the present time. And a third is doing primary research to support a developing concept that he calls uh, spiritual capital. Very interesting uh, work going on uh, in the case of these students. I teach uh, the MA module communication skills for um, criminal justice and crime control. I teach two undergraduate uh, modules, one in the sociology of work and another on digital citizenship. And I also lead, <coughs> excuse me, a uh, university-wide foundation module, uh, which is a group challenges module. Thanks for listening.